Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Really quick tutorial today. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how I turned myself into Tia Dalma, aka Calypso from Pirates of the Caribbean. I'm starting off with a clean face with some added moisturizer. With my face prepped, I'm going to take my Maybelline concealer and conceal my under eye circles, as well as add a light layer of highlight. Once I have the concealer where I want it, I take a damp beauty blender and blend it out. Next, using CoverGirl's Clean Fresh Skin Milk Foundation, I'm going to add a few drops and blend it out over my face. I want a very light base. Taking P. Louise Base, I apply a bit of the product to my lid to prep it for eyeshadow. Now taking a darker P. Louise Base, I begin doing my contour. You do not have to use this base to contour. Feel free to use whatever cream contour methods you're comfortable using. I will say that this is a look you can definitely achieve with whatever makeup products you probably already have on hand since it does only require basic colors. So here I am just blending out the contour. I am looking at a reference of some of her photos from the movie. Her cheekbones are more prominent than mine so I'm really going to cheese out <laughs> cheese. Um, no, I'm going to chisel out my cheekbones and carve out my nose so it somewhat resembles hers. And I'm going to bring the contour up into the brow area. This will just help my nose look a little more prominent. Moving on to eyebrows, I'm going to start brushing through my brow hairs with the Benefit Cosmetics 24 Hour Brow Setter. Then I'm going in with their Precisely My Brow Pencil in the shade 4. I'm making sure to keep the eyebrows fairly thin because in the movie, obviously she doesn't have Instagram fleeky eyebrows. And I'm going to keep the eyebrows fairly straight with the slightest of arches. Going in with a darker shade of contour powder, I'm going to really chisel out my nose area. And with the same contour, I'm going to shade around the outer V of my eyes. Highlighting the bridge of my nose with some more P. Louise base because I kind of muddied it with the contour. Taking a powder brush and brown from the Eye Magic Cosmetics palette, I'm going to stipple that color across various areas of my face just to make it look like I am dirty. I stipple it along my under eye bags, along my cheekbones, and as you can see my forehead and around my mouth area. Next I am taking the KVD Super Pomade in the shade Graphite and I'm going to apply this along my lash line and then smudge it out. With this pomade you do kind of have to work quickly otherwise once it's set it's not going to blend, it's, it's just difficult so work quickly if you are using this. Otherwise, you can use any black smudgeable eyeliner. Next, I am blending out that smudginess with a dark brown eyeshadow and bringing that under my lower lash line. You don't necessarily have to be precise with this, so be free. Now with the KBD Super Pomade again and a liner brush, I am going to draw on her facial markings. They're really simple, so I'm just going to do some little dashes under my eyes. Go ahead and add a second row because she has two rows of these little dash markings. Following the reference photo, I'm doing the same thing under the chin. For my lips, I don't have a black lipstick, so I'm using more of the KBD Super Pomade in Graphite. And I am blending it out with my finger. This lip doesn't have to be precise. You do want to have it a little smudgy around the edges and messy. For this next bit, I want my teeth to look like they're rotting. So using Ben Nye's Tooth FX Alcohol Activated Palette, I'm going to paint my teeth. Make sure your teeth are dry, otherwise the paint won't stick. Paint black in between your teeth for added effect. And lastly, a little bit of mascara so my lashes blend in with the rest of my makeup. You don't have to do this part, but I am because I'm taking pictures, just using a little bit of soul body oil to make myself look glistening, oily, a little sweaty. I did add a little gloss because my look was a little too matte, but besides that, the look is done. Spray yourself with a lot of dewy setting spray, that way you look sweaty. 
like the pirates in the movie because obviously they're out on the seas on a boat that doesn't have air conditioning so why would they have a matte complexion anyways i hope you guys like this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and don't forget to follow me on ig at omally until next time mally cats Thank you.